Are we live? Yes, guys, we're putting here live on the George Northwest East Side, guys. Today is Sunday Fun Day, guys. It's the fucking lockdown still going on, guys, to the 30th. But Detroit residents, guys, has not practiced social distancing at all. I can't even walk up to a fucking bus. They're Show the traffic around there, guys. There's so much traffic. They're spinning cars. Come on, I can come up. Guys, I can't even go even take my ass a fucking bus ride. Come on. <laughs> It's free to report the live guys from Detroit Northwest East Side guys. This is the quarantine guys. Unsanitary residents in Detroit guys. I, can, I might as well ride the bus. This is fucking unsanitary live. All right, you just seen that video, man. Shout out to the person that got the video, man. Uh, they was on Detroit's northeast side somewhere. I'm not really familiar with the east side like that. Um, where they was out here, you know, having a car show, partying. And um, obviously, you see the young man with his mask on. So let's talk about it. Hit that subscribe button, bell icon button, share the video. And like I said, all the Detroiters that's complaining about uh, going back to work and, and, and under the coronavirus, you know, uh, you know, situation. You know, you see what the city is just diso being disobedient towards uh, social distancing. And it's showing that we like one of the highest states as far as the coronaviruses, as far as the cities, the highest cities. We shouldn't be nowhere near L.A. in um, New York City. They have well over millions and millions of people there. Detroit is almost below the 500,000 mark, around 650,000 people is in the Detroit area. And it used to peak at 2.5 million. So we shouldn't be nowhere near, you know, uh, we we shouldn't be nowhere near the highest. And it just lets you know, man, people in Detroit is very, very ignorant. And they don't have any regards for their lives. And that shows every day when they're killing over cell phones, breaking into honest working people's homes. And it shows right now with the coronavirus. You know what I'm saying? You had multiple street fights, you know, set up during the coronavirus and people not wearing masks and they show up to another street fight wearing masks, you know, with kids and teens and, you know, teens not regarding it. It's just a lot of ignorance going around and send them back to work. Open the city up. If people get sick and they die, people not listening. No way. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, that just shows you the, the ignorance. Like you just can't sit at home long enough to, to, to let this clear up and, and, and to, and to let people get safe and let the babies go back to, to safe environment and go back to a safe school. It just lets you know why a lot of people left Detroit and went down south. And like I said before, I contemplated it hard picking up and, and leaving. I tried to stick it out in the city um, and keep it black. But for the for the sanity of my mind and for the, the health of my family and myself, like I said, I, I'm, I'm seriously considering moving out, moving out of Detroit. Maybe still in Michigan, maybe going down south or somewhere. You know, all things being considered, like, I'm really thinking about leaving because it's just too much ignorance here, bro. Too much ignorance. You know, people going to get sicker and sicker and sicker. How hard is it to sit in the house? You know what I'm saying? You know, and people not wearing masks and people still trying to party and have backyard parties. You see the cops dying, you know, from coronavirus. You see the first kid died from the coronavirus the other day. So just let you know, man, that. When we all crying about going back to work and under safe, you know, under under safe, under unsafe, you know, uh, practices. Remember that video. Remember the 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 sixteen hundred citations they wrote. Remember the twenty six, twenty seven, thirty parties they had to break up. Remember at Rouge Park when you wasn't listening. Remember when they had all these street fights going on. You know, you don't care about your lives, but you want the government to care about your lives. It's just just ignorant. And imagine, you know, the parties and the get-togethers that we don't see. Somebody just had like a Mexican fiesta up the street the other, the, the, uh, like two weekends ago. To send their ass back to work. Y'all go back to them plants. I don't want to hear y'all, oh, we can get sick and we can die. I ain't trying to hear it. A lot of y'all motherfuckers out there partying anyway. You know, the essential workers go out there every day dealing with, dealing with it. So get y'all mask on, get y'all gloves on. And everybody go back to work. Open the gyms back up. Open the movie theaters back up. Because the small businesses are the one that are the ones that's really really suffer from this. You know what I'm saying? But hey, just my opinion on it, man. But let me know what you guys think. And it's just you know, and, and you know what they saying for people outside of Detroit. You know, Livonia and you know up there and you know you know uh, uh, Grand Rapids and Ben Harbor and Jackson and Adrian and 
all the other places, Kalamazoo. Look at them ignorant niggas. Exactly what they saying. And at, and at that point, I can't even defend it no more. At that point, you can't defend it. But hey, it is what it is. Appreciate everybody for checking in. Motor Street Sports Talk. Check our current news playlist out. I'm going to have more uh, current news videos coming. So uh, pay attention. Don't forget to check my other channel, Goodfellow Sports TV out. I talk about music, entertainment, hip-hop, boxing, everything. NBA, NFL. So it's Goodfellow Sports TV. Uh, check out the other channel, Mercy Sports Talk 2.0, just in case the channel get hacked. Check out our podcast. The link's in the description. I'll be adding on that to that this week. Appreciate the love support. Want to make a donation? Cash out, PayPal, description. Best way to donate, share the video one time for the one time. It's your boy CJ Goodfellow, Mercy Sports Talk. We gone.